As dam levels remain low in the southeast, steps are being taken to make sure there's no health threat to residents. SEQ Water is introducing a new testing system which can warn authorities of looming problems instantly. Just below the Wybanho Dam wall, you'd hardly know there was a drought. Crystal clear liquid gold. SEQ water staff tested manually just to make sure it is OK. What we're seeing and what we understand of the water quality as it stands at the moment in our storages is that the water quality is good. In the dam, where the level has dropped so much, 16 metres at the wall, they test with what's called a river surveyor. You can uh, see all the way to the bottom, uh, travel help, tell how fast the water's moving. But all this monitoring still has to be scientifically sampled. Now they're going one step further instant results, thanks to new water quality detectors that are about to be used for the first time. It's an Australian first and has been trialled successfully in the Thames in London. It might be set up with a mobile device, um, we can ring it like it's got a phone number, da download the data that it's collected and then we can look at that data on a computer back in head office. It's a 24-7 operation. It scans for the first signs of trouble like algal blooms and much more. Things like turbidity, uh, salinity, water temperature, uh, dissolved oxygen. SEQ Water says it's confident there won't be any drought related health issues. In fact it says there's a better chance of that happening if there's a flood. Right now it's good. Uh, when we start getting some more quantity in the storage it's probably when we're going to be more concerned about water quality. A risk we'd all be willing to take if it meant the storages were filling up. John Sluter, 7 News.